Agroecology applies ecological principles in designing and managing farming systems to minimize the use of external or artificial inputs. It also shortens the food chain and empowers smallholder farmers to strengthen their relationship with consumers. Despite the fact that farmers in Uganda are benefiting from agricultural production, they however face several marketing challenges. To address the challenges, Pelham Uganda developed and is implementing the PESA Agro Enterprise Marketing Model. The PESA model ensures a systematic process for farmers to plan for agroecological markets and guides the marketing of any given enterprise. The PESA model promotes unique agroecological principles in production in order to give sustainable agriculture an economic perspective. The unique features of the PESA model are, it is farmer-led, promotes and facilitates effective interactions between key chain actors to enable collective decisions. The model is phased in nature, which allows for a systematic intake, implementation and rollout to the comfort of the smallholder farmers. It promotes participatory planning and assessment. The PESA model addresses six marketing challenges farmers commonly face. Number one, low volumes of agroecological products on the market due to lack of collective marketing. To address this challenge and achieve proper marketing, in Module 1, the PESA model supports farmers in the organization of marketing groups. By doing so, the model strengthens leadership and governance processes. Number 2. Poor market information. Often, specific market conditions or other influencing factors are not known and result in low prices and bad marketing. In Module 2, the PESA model builds the capacity of farmers to conduct market research and calculate profitability. It also analyzes the strengths, weaknesses, opportunities and threats associated with agroecological products and the selection of profitable enterprises. Number 3. Limited understanding of the business environment, which may cause losses, unnecessary expenses or bad decisions for the future of the enterprise. For farmers to better understand the business environment, in Module 3, the PESA model introduces farmers to map and analyze selected value chains and enterprises. By doing so, it describes actors and stakeholders as well as their responsibilities. It also identifies business opportunities and plans for stakeholder engagement. Number 4. Inadequate planning. The centerpiece of the PESA model is the development of a business plan in Module 4. Here, the model supports farmers to come up with their own business ideas and design models. This section of the model introduces business plans and entrepreneurship skills such as communication, negotiation, contracting and closing deals, marketing and self-branding, records keeping and financial planning. Number 5. Engagement of other stakeholders. The engagement with other stakeholders is important, especially for the marketing of agroecological products, to benefit from the practiced, sustainable agriculture. That is the reason why, in Module 5, farmers are guided on how to plan and engage with relevant stakeholders for better agroecological marketing. And finally, number 6. Implementation of the business. A business plan is nothing to a farmer if not adequately implemented. So Module 6 of the PESA model leads farmers in the implementation of the business plan and how to practically close deals, access financial services, and observe and obtain market standards and launching the business. Pelham Uganda believes that by farmers coming together with other actors, they will be able to market their agroecological products at higher prices, access markets, manage agro-businesses sustainably, and improve incomes.